Blondine Moyer. So we've got great examples of su successful entrepreneurs already in our city, names that everyone knows. Think back about some of our early volunteers. Colonel Sanders, I don't know if they called him an entrepreneur back in the day, but he did a hell of a job. Matt Wynn started Churchill Downs. He had a dream as well. More current names, Junior Bridgman, David Jones, Alice Houston, Doug Cobb, Mike Davis, Young Wynn, Debbie Scapecchio. These are all of our peers, and there's hundreds more that have built, whether they're billion-dollar enterprises or hundred-million-dollar enterprises, they're all amongst us, and each one of you all, if you're not that already, could certainly be that. And what's interesting is when you start nurturing a new generation of entrepreneurs and we can see them in action, it's like a movie playing out. You know, who's going to be successful? You see people like the Tan brothers who launched Bassa Restaurant on Frankfurt Avenue, and then they did 732 Social and moved on after that. And now they're creating Doc Crows on Whiskey Row, which the New York Times talked about in its pages the week before last Sunday. So that's exciting when you see people are doing things like this. What's their next act? How many more jobs are they going to create? There's 25-year-old Matt Kubinick who turned his high school hobby of buying unique street clothes and, sh and shoes into a multi-million dollar internet site called Street Moda. Who's next? How are these companies going to go? So we need more Ton Brothers and more Matt Kubinex and more Colonel Sanders and more Matt Wins out there, more entrepreneurs who are ready to take a risk for themselves and for their city. And the best thing about being an entrepreneur is at your core you believe that the purpose of an enterprise is to help people realize their potential as human beings, whether it's those that work for you or those that you can help because of the success of your enterprise. And at the end of the day, there's nothing that feels better than, any, than that.